if you have a question for Alex, please raise your hand. We'll go to Brian Hedger. Go ahead, Brian. Hey, Alex. Um, you know, a, a number of guys in your locker room had become pretty good friends uh, with, with Pierre-Luc Dubois, obviously. I believe you were one of those guys. Is it tough for you to see him, uh, you know, traded like this? And, and uh, just your thoughts on that whole deal. Yeah, I mean, uh, I mean that's part of probably that's part of the business. But he's uh, still my 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 good friends, and yeah, uh, I wish him all the best in uh, Winnipeg. And uh, yeah, I will I will text him and call him, uh, you know, every time. And yeah, he's uh, he just helped me when I got here with the language and everything. So I appreciate that. And uh, yeah, I wish I wish him all the best. Was it difficult for you guys, especially you guys who were friends with him over these last three weeks, you know, knowing that situation was not great? Yeah, I mean, uh, between him and me, uh, we haven't talked about that. We just, uh, you know, talk about, you know, soccer and, you know, how is it in France, stuff like that. So we we haven't talked a lot about this. It's his business. That's not my business. So he's just take care of, of that. And, uh, yeah, he, He's a really good friend, and uh, and like I say, uh, yeah, that's 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 part of the hockey. Are you uh, are you ready to uh, to do this center thing potentially full time now? Maybe. Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm ready for everything. Uh, when I step on the ice, if I'm center or wing, doesn't matter. I'm just gonna just gonna play my game and put everything on the ice. Last one for me. I know I know it's early um, in the season, but you you know obviously uh, consistently scoring, getting on the the score sheet. Do you start to are you starting to feel like you're kind of you know coming into your own and, and you know really proving yourself at the NHL level even more? Oh uh, yeah, I just feel confident on the ice. I don't think too much, and uh, yeah, I know I know the league a bit better than last year, so. Uh, you know, in this kind of game, yeah, you just have to play hard. That's the only thing I can control. So that's that's the only thing I'm I'm trying to do every night. And uh, I am I I'm having fun out there. That's the most important thing for me. Okay. Next, we go to Dave Metzold. Go ahead, Dave. Tex, you did a lot of work to uh, set up Zach's goal. I'm wondering if you could just kind of take us through that a little bit and tell us what you saw as you were looking for for the pass that ultimately led to Zach's goal. Oh, yeah, nothing special. I was behind the net, tried to give it to Bjorki, and he missed the net. And uh, I got it uh, on the other side from uh, behind the net, and Z was open, so I just give it to him. And, uh, yeah, he's a how much really uh, player, so he was, yeah. Sorry for interrupting. How much, how much gratification comes with setting up a goal like that? Again, given the, the amount of work it took to create that play. Yeah, I think that that's good, but that's what I learned uh, last year, you know. Made, made a good play, but uh, that's that, that's behind me. I mean, uh, yeah, that's that's a good thing, but uh, you know, I have to do it again uh, ne the next game. You know, it's a uh, you know big 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 win for us tonight, but uh, we have to keep going. Not only a big win tonight, but over the two games, you take three points from the defending Stanley Cup champs. What does that do for uh, for the team's confidence? Maybe from your confidence as well. Yeah, that's huge. That's huge, but. Uh, we only play a couple of games, so we have to, you know, find find our game. We we play better tonight, but uh, we, I think we can still still be better on the on the next one. Thanks, Tex. Yeah. Next, we'll go to Mark Shy. Go ahead, Mark. Thank you. Hey, Alex. Um, you spent a lot of the game today defending one of the best players in the NHL and Braden Point. Just how much has that helped your confidence? You know, you're learning the center position, but being able to keep up with one of the fastest players in the league. Yeah, I think that's good. Uh, that's exactly where I want to play. Uh, I'm here to play against the the best best uh, best player in the league. So, I mean, I'm uh, I'm happy. I was a uh, you know pretty good player. I I actually learned from from them on the face off. I watched some video and uh, yeah, it's uh, it's nice. I like it and uh, you know I'm not gonna change my game because I play against uh, the top top guy. But I'm gonna. Be aware of of my game a little bit in my in the defensive uh, defensive zone. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Alex. Thank you.